A local middle school teacher is on administrative leave after she was arrested following an alleged altercation with a student. KSPY's Jacob Dizon has more on the potential charges she is facing. San Luis Obispo County Sheriff officials say during class yesterday, deputies arrived here at Mesa Middle School on reports of battery committed by a teacher against a 13-year-old student. Neither the Lucia Mar Unified School District nor the Sheriff's Office would talk today on the matter, but this afternoon I caught up with a local defense attorney who weighed in on the possible charges that could follow. There's some minimum terms that are required to be imposed by the judge uh, if the person's found guilty. According to the sheriff's office, at around 11.30 Tuesday morning, Mesa Middle teacher, 42-year-old Sarah Watts, reportedly pulled a hairbrush from a female student's hand, leaving visible injuries behind. Their report says Watts also threw paper at a group of middle schoolers, which left the same student with a cut to her temple. Meanwhile, though he's unaffiliated with this specific case, San Luis Obispo defense attorney Elon Funky Bilu says if Watts is convicted on the charges, the severity of repercussions could vary. He can go to jail up to one year in jail for misdemeanor child abuse, but for felony child abuse, you can go for years to prison. Funky Bilu says if Watts is found guilty on the charges, a judge will likely impose a restraining order between her and the student and require her to undergo a 52-week child endangerment class. This morning, I also spoke with Sarah Watts over the phone, but she told me she wouldn't be able to interview until she consulted with her attorney. In Arroyo Grande, Jacob Dizon, KSBY News. And we also reached out to the Lucia Mar Teachers Association for comment, but did not hear back. Watts was released from jail after posting bail early this morning.